Right, good morning folks. You find me here in the Stobswell area of Dundee this morning. Where now, I was going to be going to get my phone upgraded today folks, but um, I don't know. I just don't know if I could be bothered with it all. So anyway, so we've come for a little stroll around the Stobswell uh, area, as I said, where they're going to be doing a thing called the Stobs Fest this year. And they've painted some doors and stuff, so we're going to go and have a look, see if we can find anything, anything of interest. It's a very special park bench, this one. So commemorates the Haparanda. Yes, right, the Haparanda. Here it is. The location. Right, folks, so here it is. This is the very uh, place where there used to be a place in Dundee called the Haparanda. It's kind of like a, just a, a club for the youngsters to come and uh, meet back in the 60s. And this is it here, folks. There we go. This is where it used to be, and this is the bench that is dedicated to it right here on the Arbor of Road, the Haparanda. Cheers. Well, folks, and a big shout out there to Jimmy, who I just met. Jimmy, he, uh, he watches all the Spiz videos. Um, and he was, he says he's seen me play before back in the old days, he's an old punk rocker, so nice one. Now, this, this, um, is one of the, the bus stops that I used to stand, folks, uh, all the time getting the last bus home when I used to work along in Arthurston Terrace. And the last bus was about half eleven, so we used to go to the pub along the road there and hang about. And this is it right here. It's been an old jute, jute mill here, folks. You can see it's still got its art deco sort of thing still there, look. Right, folks, I've no idea where these doors are situated, so I just have to sort of have a, just a bit of a, a wander about and see what we can come up with. I may remember, folks, last year I did a video on the worst close in Dundee, and this was it right here, but since then, it's got a new door put in way. Look, it's got a new door. It looks like it's got new glass being put into it as well. So it's all been done up. Yes. Excellent. Right, folks, here we are now in this very famous phone box. This was used by a, uh, a blackmailer. I can't remember the details. I'll, I'll try and find out, folks. I have been in here before and I did exactly the same. I couldn't remember what was going on. But he used this place to blackmail. I'm sure it's Tesco and he put glass inside baby milk or something or baby food and this is the very phone box where he did his nefarious phone calls from folks yes there it is right there all right here we go got part of the uh the silvery tay the railway bridge disaster poem here on the wall land and oh cakes land oh cakes excellent Folks, there's one of the doors we found. Waiting to cats. In Forte's Cafe, folks. We found this. I don't know if this is one of the doors or if it's just part of the um, this thing here. Whatever this is, technology is a useful servant, but a dangerous master. Indeed, it is. Found another one, here we go. <coughs> the primary colours. That's sore in the eyes, that one, crikey. I'm not sure this is, I don't think this is part of it, but there we go, got a little drawing on the side of the wall here, look. It's been done by Darlene by name. There we go, another one here, folks. Good one, that one. My oh, yes. another one. Folks, I found a mural to Billy. Billy Mackenzie, look. Excellent. Now, folks, I'm not actually sure when the Stob Fest is. Um, I'm not sure how far the Stobs Well area stretches around Dundee, I don't actually know, but I found this uh, this other kind of dove, a dove 
mural just here kind of goes all the way up here and over this used to be the old snooker hall there we go yeah this used to be the old princess snooker hall i'm sure of it I used to go in there all the time Right, folks, I've come out of the city. Yes, I just had to get out of the city. So we've come up here to Tully Backett to breathe in some fresh air and uh, take a stroll and see what's going on. Now, let's see what's up this way. I've always been up that way before, up into the Tully Backett area, but never to this uh, Lead Creef bait fishing, fly fishing, toilet snacks and permits area. So we'll take a stroll up that way, I think. Well, I've just, just started walking along, folks, and it started to rain. Just little spittles. Here we've got some elephant grass growing straight there. Look at that. Right there. Anglers, cars only. You are being watched. Oh, no. An odd thing. Where is it? Through this gate is it? I don't know. How does this work? Got this nice house over there, look. Right. Well I must must say didn't expect to be having a bit of a peck up a hill this afternoon man. Goodness. Right, slowly heading up here. Oh. Oh my goodness, I've made it to the top, folks. There we go. Oh, yes. Thank you. Right, folks, I've made it up to the top here. It's really, really windy up here, but look at the view. Fantastic, man. Awesome. There's a little cane up here, so I'm going to leave a spiz badge. A spiz card up here. Whoa, excellent. Okay, all you spiz fans, I'm way at the top here off Tully back at viewpoint. It's only a 0.6 kilometre walk, but my, it's a bit uh, windy up the top here, so I've left a, a spiz badge right at this this cairn if anybody wants it, folks. Well worth it for the views. Look. Right, folks, I can get rid of these old manky boots now. These boots have been on the go for a good few years, so they've done me well. They have indeed. Lots of spiz adventures, but they end their days here in a bit of a, a state in a wee bit. Boom. Up a tully bucket. They served me well. Okay, folks, well, there we go. I think that's going to be the end of today's outdoors segment of this wonderful day it's been a nice clear but blustery day anyway i'm gonna go home now and see what what else happens all right folks my, my day ends here sitting eating a mcflurry yes i went and got a mcflurry they've run out of camera ones so couldn't i get a cadbury cream egg one it's not quite as good but hey ho so we'll only have about half of that and then just head home now so thank you for watching as always folks Cheers for subscribing. All the comments, thank you very much for yesterday's comments, folks, on all those three, three videos you got yesterday. I know, fantastic. So thank you, folks. I know you appreciate them. I know you like them. Oh, that's why I do them. That's why I do them for you guys. That is why. That is the reason. You are the reason. So thank you, and we'll see you again sooner. Thank you, folks. Thank you.